Hi guys, Shen from Yanomize, and today we're going to do something a little bit different to my Porsche. You guys know that I bought this car, I love the colour, and that is why I haven't wrapped it. However, it does need something. It needs to be PPF'd. What's PPF? Paint protection film. As you guys know, everyone knows us for wrapping. We wrap different colours, we do chrome, we do mad bright colours, we do satin, we do stealth, we do greys. Yes, we are going to be doing PPF. I'm going to introduce you to a new member of staff called Jason. He's been doing PPF for many, many years, and his first car that he's going to do is the Bottis car. Jason, come in. Welcome to the family. He's been with us about a month now. He can actually rap as well. However, he's the man when it comes to PPF. He's been dying to get his hands on one of my cars. So, no pressure. First PPF car you're going to do at Yanomai is going to be the Bottis car. And assuming he does a great job, which I know he will, we will then start PPFing for everyone else. But guys, meet Jason. Hi, my name is Jason, just started in Yanimize and we're about to do PPF on Yanis car. On the screen right now is his car. You got the bonnet, the wings, the doors, front bumper, back bumper, quarter, and even the A-pillar is here. Small tiny bit is just right here. And the wing mirror. On the PPF side, we try to minimize the waste and maximize the space. I.e. I got the wing here, I can drag it here and plot it. And I got one here, alternate. And I try to rearrange on the significant amount of film. Instead of using three meters or four meters, I can use it within two and a half. We get a pattern, now let's cut it out. Okay, the car is in the unit. First things first, we check the imperfection of the car. The car has been chipped or damaged, scratches, just to cover yourself before the installation. Check as well for any dents, paint imperfections, obviously, and chipped, uh, chipped, because it will show. As you guys know, we've never done PPF at Yanomai before. First time, personally, I'm seeing it done. Very, very, very different to wrapping. Can't get no creases in that and can't heat it out. You can see everything under PPF. It's really hard to not get dust. Wrapping is dry, PPF is all wet, maybe you stick at the floor. We're everywhere. I better get back to work. But see you in a bit. I don't want no combo, I want checks. I don't want the second, I want best. I'm all in my ass, way, I'm alright. I've been moving like I had met. First thing you need to do is spray the panel. Hands should be wet as well to prevent marks on the film. With the salad, like it's a remedy. I mix it up inside the pot. Watch it drip while it drop, drop. Time to take it to the top. It's not really a straightforward process. It requires uh, intricate attention to details. You need to make sure that you keep on spraying and spraying. Upon laying it, important bit is alignment and positioning. It needs the repositioning and alignment of your pattern. Push it, stop there. Check. I don't want the second, I want this. I'm all in my ass way, I'm all right. On this particular car, we're using the new Avery Denison SPF X1 high gloss film. Uh, this film is 
optically clear so essentially there's no colour tinge to it whatsoever so your original colour will come through all it's going to do is intensify that and make it a lot more glossy but of course it's the added protection of stopping any kind of stone chips or light abrasions on the vehicle as well by having the PPF on the vehicle so Jason's doing his thing at the moment he's going to cut through the camera what are you doing? It's like a man at work here this is like, this is really? that's Jason <laughs> There you go, crack on, that's what we're doing. So we're halfway through the video. Something that I thought I would talk about is my relationship with Topaz. Myself, Mazin and Nabil, the owners of Topaz, are on great terms. I spoke to Mazin just before I shot this video. So anyone out there that's gonna try and stir things up between us, there's no issues. Yanomize and Topaz are still friends, so I just wanted to address that before anyone tries to blow it up from nowhere. Myself and Topaz had a gentleman's agreement. If you rang Yanomize and said, do you guys PPF? We'd be like, no, call Topaz. And if you rang Topaz and said, do you guys rap? They'd be like, no, call Yanomize. Over the years, PPF has evolved. So PPF was always clear protection and we were always color change. PPF then brought out matte and satin PPF, which is obviously similar to what we do here. We are the color change experts. That is what we do here. So it made sense that Yanomize as a brand, as a company, would go into the PPF field. There's no issue with Topaz, we've explained to them why we're going into the field, and they understand. Jason originally came to me as a rap guy, and when he came in, he said to me, you know I can PPF as well? I was like, really? He was like, yeah. I said, okay, you know what? To what level? Are you a better rapper or a better PPF guy? He goes, I'm a better PPF guy. So I thought, you know what? Let me try him, let me test him. And I called Mazin, I said, Mazin, I've hired this guy, he told me he can do PPF, if he's good, I may start doing that. He's now PPF my car, as you can see in this video, and he's done a fantastic job. Okay guys, the car is 100% complete. I'm, I'm very pleased. I'm going to it. And let me call Yanni. And see how it goes. What are you saying? Is that good? <laughs> <laughs> we'll just <laughs> we'll run with that. That's cool. So there it is. My freshly PPF'd Porsche 992 Carrera 4S cab. Jason's done a fantastic job. I'm really happy. Obviously, it looks exactly the same as it was at the start of the video. However, it is now fully protected. Every single panel has been done. Let me show you where we're going to be doing PPF. So this is the back unit. It looks amazing. It's not quite yet complete. However, my guy's going to work this weekend and officially will be open next week. 